All right, guys, today is the big day, the biggest freaking day ever. It is time finally to take delivery of the Jeep Gladiator 6x6, a video that has been roughly a month and a half in the making. We're about to go pick up Ladesh in the truck and uh, then head over to the dealership. I think I'm gonna put a long sleeve shirt on though because it's a little cold today. YouTube is a crazy place. It seems like everyone has a Lambo. Now, I love this car. I will always own one because it's amazing. They don't really get the views anymore. I mean, a lot of people have them. Anyone can buy one. The 6x6 is so unique. Now, Stradman has has one and I've talked to him a few times maybe we can get together to make a video that would be sweet but I feel like the 6x6 is so different you know it's not a Lambo a Corvette it's just it's so unique it's in a class of its own anyway I can't wait to bring you guys along for this journey and we're about to have a great time let's do it bad news the truck has arrived um, but we I'm, I'm saying to make the driver wait now normally I wouldn't say that I would say you know what uh, he's there early, great. But we actually went last night. We're so calling. You want to call? What's up, B? Sure. What's up, buddy? Here we go. We're just sitting here waiting. See what he says. We're hanging out, waiting. Hey, this is Matt calling from Whitmoyer Chevrolet. The driver. And, uh, you have the 6x6 six six to drop off tonight? Uh, actually, uh, did I drop off tomorrow morning? There you go. Uh, just coming to Washington, D.C. right now. You're in Washington, D.C. right now? Yeah. Oh. There's no possible way you would get here tonight then? No. Yeah, I'm gonna be there to do it tonight around the 12th or 1 o'clock. And I'll play the footage because he said he would be there. We wait for what, an hour, like an hour 15, hour and a half? And then he said he calls and says, oh, by the way, I'm still in Washington. Washington is roughly 110 miles away. So we're making him wait. This ain't good, not at all, not good. There is never traffic on this somebody's highway. Somebody's morning commute went horrible. Yeah, horrid. somebody must have crashed. Oh, I don't like this at all. Not good at all. What are we doing? All I want is to get my dang six by six and I, the universe keeps holding me back. I mean, we could, we could just drive off into that field, no problem. It's funny, like traffic laws, like we, we have to, obey, like I can't drive off the road but obviously like I could, I could easily, like we all listen to the rules. Doubt there would be any consequences if you did something like that, because usually there aren't any cops, maybe like not until the accident. So you could get away with it, but nobody does because you don't want to be that guy in front of everyone else. It's like when you're at the grocery store, you don't want to be the person who leaves the cart, like just free. There was like an entire conspiracy theory on the yeah, cart it's, like a, it's like a, it's like a psychological experiment. People don't want it. You don't want to look like the guy who's passing traffic. I don't know what this is, but um, we were making great time. Palms are sweaty, like for where they actually weak. are. Knees not really weak. Arms are, aren't really heavy. I'm not throwing up any spaghetti, but it's here. Oh, look at it, dude! It's ridiculous. It's absolutely ridiculous. Oh my God. <laughs> this is it guys, this is it. There is our driver. I do appreciate him waiting uh, because I want to see this moment. Thank you for waiting, I really appreciate it. I wanted to see it come off the truck. Oh, this sure? Yeah, yes sir. <laughs> it's gonna be awesome, I can't wait. Oh heck yeah. <laughs> so much crazier in person. All right, let's park. Let Ash get the, get the real camera out. I'm working. Stat. It is, it's hard to capture on video like that's an f-150 there it is it is absolutely massive oh my god look at how freaking big it is oh my god oh it's crazy that's ridiculous look at how freaking big the truck you got to pan the whole way it takes five minutes oh, that's <laughs> that's me. i'm the owner of the car uh wow Wow, Bro, how dude. crazy does it look though in real life? It's wilder than <laughs> it's I freaking... thought it was gonna be. I mean, look, the tires are bigger than on the 18 wheeler. Yeah. You always say this the about a lot of stuff. Oh, it's got automatic, automatic steps? Yeah. Dude, I didn't even know, I don't even know what we ordered. What's cool about this is Beaver did a lot of this because you guys are a dealer for these. Yeah. If you want, literally, Whitmoyer can now sell you a 6x6 six six Jeep, which is really cool. Sick. Now it's a, you know, it's pricey, 130K for this one. Well, do you think you'll get anyone who buys one? I hope. I hope so, I wanna sell another one. Yeah. yeah. Well, because here's the deal, you know, like in that price range, 130, 140, you can get a uh, McLaren 570, you can get, uh, you know, C8 Corvette, obviously a little cheaper than that. You can't get anything with the shock value. Like anyone can buy a McLaren, whatever, used Gallardo, 
this is like you will never see anything like it on the road if you're driving it nobody has anything like it It's like not even real. It's like I was saying, 130K, you can get like a McLaren 570, right. Gallardo, whatever, you know, some cool stuff, but nothing has the shock value no, of no, that. No, no. You, you will never see one. This, yeah. You'll automatically shut it down. You will never see one. No. <laughs> this so, is the second one off production. <laughs> it's so crazy. Look at how long the bed is. So eight foot bed, pretty cool. Huge thank you guys to next level for the build very quick turnaround great process easy people to talk to and under, work with under a month. they did yeah under a month uh, yeah. they did great you know they did great on the truck it, everything looks cool looks good great uh build quality on everything now we're gonna test it we are gonna put it to the test are you ready check that out you hop right in the mods don't stop on the outside guys interior as well look at that beautiful seats next level there on the headrest as well Oh man, it's a lot. To, it's a lot to take in, right? A lot to uh, to take in. Overwhelming. There, there's so much, uh, both mechanically, cosmetically, so many things to go over. I'm like really kind of overwhelmed. I want to talk to you guys about everything. Uh, what can I say? True six by six number one i know i'm gonna get that question now a lot of times when you see a six by six jeep or whatever they're not true they're dragging a rear axle if you're gonna drive around only on the street that's not such a it's not a huge deal for me though it's lame like if you're gonna get one with six wheels make it real six wheel drive this one is real you can see no uh bluetooth drive shafts or anything like that it is 100 percent real and functional six wheel drive a true six by six truck incredible and and for me it had to be because we are gonna off-road it i'll be using all six wheels um man that's wild it's like a luxury car yeah. so you're getting a lot for the money you're not only getting like oh jeep and then they put extra wheels on it and a different axle you're getting a lot of it's like a totally different machine it really is it started life as a brand new gladiator and it got cut apart right away you know cut apart and uh it transformed into something incredible look at the freaking bars on that sucker that is so cool. I just, I, I can't wait to like drive it. <laughs> it's so ridiculous. So ridiculous. I've had a lot of really cool, crazy stuff. I've been very lucky in my life to drive a lot of neat things. I don't think I've ever had anything as crazy as this. Like, feel free to let me know if, if you think I've had anything that tops this, but I feel like I haven't. I feel like I haven't had anything even remotely close. If we get stuck, we have the winch to get us out. Got that. Nice little cover there on the winch. So yeah, next level, they did all this. Life art, Andy! <laughs> Andy! What are you doing here? What are you doing? Oh, it's been a while, it's been a while. What are you doing here? Oh, uh, there's a C606 down here that's having some okay. tuning issues. Dude, you, I couldn't, but I was like, that's Andy. Six, true six wheel drive too. Really? No dragon axles here, buddy. No dragon Oh yeah, we're not dragon axles, we're powering them. Oh, they come right out the steps. You get up in there, wow. Oh, so cool. Look at that, brand new, 130 miles on it. I can't, I can't even talk right now. Like I have a six by six. It's incredible, it's incredible. It really is incredible. Oh my God. Automatic, <laughs> right up buddy, right up. Six inch lift in the front, I think in the back as well. It might be a little bit lower because it sits essentially completely level, which I, you know, I wanted level. 
Um, man, it, it's beautiful. Rot, huge rot sliders here hey, to protect what, them, you. Them pine ones are massive too. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you yeah. can take you can take doors off, oh, top yeah, off. It's still regular Jeep. These oh yeah. Come off, and this whole thing comes off as one unit. I'm gonna camp out up here. Yeah. I might sleep in here tonight. I might you should. Roll out the sleeping bag. Far drop. Jump. I'm jump. Should I jump? jump? All right, here we go. I'll break both my legs on camera. All right, we're we're down and drive. This is it, buddy. We're driving a six-wheel Jeep. <laughs> it feels normal, you know, normal, I guess. How it's 24 feet, right? Yeah. So it's like it's really not any longer than a full-size truck. It's about that length. A little bit longer, but not much. <laughs> Dude, the reflection, it looks <laughs> insane. It's actually kind of surprising how normal it does feel. Like you would think you would get a lot more movement yeah, from the back like end, and, you know, not. like you don't. It's pretty cool, I gotta say. Drive by cool. the showroom glass again. All right, I'll drive by the glass. I'll, I'll film the glass. Yeah. It's pretty cool, like it's neat that it works this well. I was, I was not expecting it to be bad, but you know, I was expecting it to be like kind of ridiculous. Oh yeah, look at that reflection. <laughs> Here, I'll park it in front of the showroom. We have completed the first drive and I like it. I like it. I really like it. That thing's freaking epic. It's just a six by six. I cannot wait to go to a show. That's my, like, that's all I want to do. Go to cars and whatever, cars and coffee, charity show, whatever it is. I want to go and get some reactions. CF Charity show is coming up. Whatever, I'm down. I want to get, I just want to see yeah. what people say. It'd be one thing if it only looked cool but it actually, like this truck actually works. It'd be one thing if it was like, ah, oh, you know, it looks like a, you know, a cool truck, but it doesn't do anything. This will work on the road or off the road in any scenario. It's freaking epic. Like what more, what more could you want than a Jeep with six wheels? No one will understand how long and big it is on when they're not seeing it for real, right, Ladesh? It's usually how you describe me to people before I meet them. <laughs> <laughs> Something like that, buddy. I'm genuinely now I shouldn't say this because like it's not like I was expecting it to be bad but it was very smooth like we were doing 75 80 the whole way still a Jeep you're not getting a Range Rover which everyone knows that but it was really smooth nice to drive and you really the shocking part is you wouldn't know like if you were just inside of it you wouldn't know and and I think that's crazy they've really got it figured out and love it um so i didn't really get into any of the specs of it we will in the next upload i'll talk about i'll talk about the science behind the six wheel drive i'll talk about the winch um every other little thing that we did the interior there's a lot here it really isn't just a bolt on an axle job and go like there is a lot that goes into it um if you're gonna do it you should do it right and this is done right for sure and and if you're gonna do it right there's a lot so we'll, we'll talk about all that happy to have it home it's freaking awesome rich loves what it on earth is this thing <laughs> oh my gosh it should have been here with all, all the other raptors and tx trx's and oh it's been off-roady on the Jurassic channel park 
Off-roader for sure. Big, isn't it? It's huge. <laughs> I can't believe how long it is. It's as tall as the house. Man, it is. It's as tall as the house. It's really, really long. And I can't wait to see the kinds of off-road things you can do with it. I oh, mean, yeah. That looks just awesome. Every it's time sweet. I come over here, I never know what I'm going to see. And this is just taking it to the next level. Do you think? Well, yeah, next <laughs> level. <laughs> ah, a little oh, plug God. there. But I, this is not sponsored by them. <laughs> I'm actually going to take those off, I think. I think most unique you know vehicle what? I've ever had. You know what? <laughs> the Blazer is still the bla That's favorite. true. The Blazer's that pretty so neat. It's so unique. It's so fun. Uh, it's crazy. But, I mean, as far as a nice vehicle, and the most bizarre vehicle, yeah, this, yeah. Is, this is this is going to take. He's like, well, you'll never see one. This is going to take until you get your EV. Okay. That's gonna, the Hummer EV. Yeah, the Hummer, Ooh, yeah, the Hummer I'm, EV. I'm excited about that. That that, that is going to really take the cake. But this this is really cool. A freaking it six by six. Yeah, it's huge. It's huge. Well, there you go, boys. Hope you like it. If you guys want to win my 6x6 Jeep Gladiator, quite possibly the coolest vehicle on the planet, I guarantee you if you win, nobody in your town will have one unless maybe you live in LA. InShaneDesigns.com, every $5 you spend gets you 15 automatic entries to win. We're doing 15 times entries right now. Anything and everything on the website counts. Does not matter what you get. You can get a Savage Garage key tag, you can get a, a t-shirt, you can get a backpack, the soot cleaner, the detail spray, a knife, titanium look, American flag, American flag meat cleaver, and then a new blue one. We have not uh, shown you guys that one yet. 400 guys, 400 different shirts to choose from. We have the Frenchie's Bakery Frenchie logo, nice and simple. We've got the, the piglet shirt right there with the big cake on it. Purple tank right there. I love wearing that one to work out. The purple and white ombre shirt. One of my newer shirts, the 717 crest on the front and then an American flag on the back. Woody green shirt with the flag and two other uh, things on it there. 717 star in yellow. She tags American flag, OD green, tan, blue line, all gray, Canada. And yes, if you are from Canada, you can win this Jeep Gladiator. First ever merch plug in the new shop. It's pretty cool. I can walk through the aisles, show you everything. It's all organized. Got the backpack, the black backpack there with the 717 on it. The T-Rex camo backpack. Got a few of those left over. Darker camo one there. And then the cream of the crop. Now this is one I have been waiting to reveal for a long time. And I know that he has as well the neighbor rich shirt. That's right, we've got neighbor rich merch right now. Counts for the giveaway as does everything else. But it's, it's an old uh, PA license plate. It used to say that you've got a friend in PA. Well, you've got a friend in neighbor rich with the little Keystone logo and it's like a license plate. So if you wanna get some rich merch, we've got it for you. He is very, I hope they sell well because he is so freaking hyped about it. So if you're looking to buy something, you're not sure, get a rich shirt. He'll love it. I, you know, I, I just want to tell him that like, hey, your shirt sold out. That's all I want to say to him. So if you want some rich merch, grab it now. It'll make him happy, that's for sure. But again, everything on the website counts, InShaneDesigns.com. 30 days left to win, only a month. And like I said, 15 times entries to win. The Jeep Gladiator 6x6 is live. We're only doing it for a month and it's gonna go by so fast. Hands on the wheel.
<laughs> How long until the cops show up? I'm down. What? <laughs>